Hi and welcome to the Azam Sharp YouTube channel. I'm your host Mohammad Azam with another screencast and this screencast will be about iBeacon and how to get started with iBeacon. Now in the last screencast I showed you that how you can configure your Mac to be to serve as an iBeacon. Now luckily uh, this time I actually do have an iBeacon device KS Technologies. They were very kind enough to send me a sample piece. Uh, so their iBeacon is known as Particle. And uh, let me actually show it to you. It's a neat product, uh, nice and small. Uh, let's go ahead and I'll try to show it to you by using Reflector, Reflection. All right, hold on a second. So I'm just going to use the the camera over here to show it to you. So here is the, the uh, particle product of KS Technologies. Um, it's a pretty small device as you can see. An interesting thing is that they, they have a, a hook over here so you can uh, run a thread and then tie it with your pet or anything that you will not likely to lose. Now you can see that I have actually opened it up a little bit and uh, I'll show you why I have opened it up, okay? All right, so let's get back now. Now this also comes with the uh, application. It's called Acceler Particle Accelerator. You can download it from uh, the App Store and this application is from KS Technologies. It will allow you to, you know, see the major ID, the minor ID, as well as other different other aspects of the particle uh, the eye beacon that you are carrying yourself uh, let me go ahead and stop this sharing and go ahead and check out their website really nice price uh, KS Technologies uh, the, the thing that is necessary for you to get started with the uh, UUID uh, so all the particle system of KS Technologies, they are equipped with this default UUID and then the major ID is one and minor ID is one. Now if you have been following the last article, that is all we need to get started with iBeacon development. Start ranging, stop monitoring, so we have already seen all of those things, right? Uh, let's go ahead and run the app over here actually I'm going to run it on the simulator because right now it's uh, really not going to do anything it's just going to display uh, a small lift now this is the application that we will be working on it's called Monk's Cafe why Monk's Cafe well I'm a huge Seinfeld nerd and the restaurant that they show in Seinfeld is called Monk's Cafe but in real life it's called Tom's restaurant that's another uh, another talk for some other time I guess so what we're going to do is uh, right now for to keep things simple is we are going to send out a greeting message like welcome to Monk's Cafe when you actually enter into the region of uh, the iBeacon and whenever you leave it's going to say okay goodbye kind of like that so we're going to implement those two things. Please note that we have already set up the UUID which we can find uh, easily from the Particle Accelerator app which is produced by KS Technologies or the KS Technologies website as I have showed you over here so you can find these things to configure your particle system um, and we are sending the major ID 1 and minor ID 1 as indicated by uh, KS Technologies and their website so let's go ahead and the the methods that we will be interested in will be did enter region and did exit region okay so let's go ahead and implement those methods over here did enter region will be triggered whenever uh, we are entering into an i beacon region and the other method is did uh, exit region which will of course be triggered whenever we are moving away from the, the region. 
okay and inside this region what we are going to do is we are simply going to send a notification this is a local notification as you can see this is not a push notification notification dot alert body now this is when we enter so i can simply say over here uh, welcome to monks cafe and then we can say notification dot uh, what is it sound name default uh, ui application share application present local notification notification now it's actually raining outside so uh, hopefully that that won't mess up the recording here we go so we're going to paste this over here uh, for the exit notification uh, and I'm just going to say goodbye uh, and that's it that's pretty much it what I'm going to say all right now I have to test this on the iPhone device so let's go over here and just say iPhone over here uh, I'm also going to mirror the iPhone so that you can see what's going on so let me go ahead and uh, start mirroring the iPhone not sure why it always start with a full screen so here we go um, let's go ahead and run this Uh, so here we go. The app is running. Monk's Cafe. Now you can see that there's nothing really going on right now. Okay. Um, so let me actually do one thing. All right. I'm going to go over and actually I can show it to you. Let me actually run the camera. All right. So what I'm doing right now is I've opened up this uh, particle iBeacon and since I cannot really move out of the region even if I go downstairs I'm actually in the region it's just far okay uh, so to literally move out of the region to the iBeacon region I have to go in the street and I don't want to get wet in the street right now because it's raining outside so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take the battery out all right uh, if I can do that with one hand Let's see, so I'm just gonna push this guy, let's see, here we go. And I'm gonna push this guy out. Okay, so that's gonna be a little bit hard. So, here we go. And I think as soon as I take the battery out, so now the battery is out, you can see, here's the battery is in my hand. All right, and hopefully after a while, maybe a couple of minutes I will get a notification that I am now out of the region and uh, we're just going to see wait a bit to see if we if we get that notification or not here we go so we got that notification right pretty cool right because now you're out of the region now I'm going to put the battery in now in my previous test, as soon as the, I put the battery in, it immediately says that, okay, you are in the region. So let's just watch what happens. There we go. So it's not even completely in yet, uh, the, the battery, and it's saying you are in the region. So that's pretty cool. So that's, that's it. I mean, uh, uh, for this, I'm just going to close it out actually now. There we go. So that's it. Uh, you can see that now you can check out that when you are going in the region, going out of the region, you can easily test it out and you can easily know that what is going on. And based on if whether you are entering the region or you are exiting the region, you can customize the message. You can give the user a sense that, okay, hey, welcome to the Monk's Cafe or goodbye and see you later kind of things. Um, but this is just a very like a start of the uh, the screencast series that I want to do on iBeacon. Uh, in the future screencast, you will see that once the person enters into uh, the region, um, the the app will automatically download the coupons associated 
uh, with that particular day or it's just going to be like a random uh, coupon for the day and then you can use these coupons to get some discounts like on big salad or uh, you know uh, something like that or soup all the things are I'm taking from Seinfeld the big salad and the soup so that's pretty much it I hope you like this uh, video tutorial and uh, once again uh, if you I highly appreciate for all the people who have been donating to Adam Sharp channel as you can imagine it uh, takes a lot of time and effort to create these videos uh, and uh, your donations are always appreciated thank you very much and stay tuned for more